everyone, welcome back to another WarioWare video. Now this time, we're gonna be playing the party minigames as all four people. Will this be as chaotic as the player, as in two player? Yes, it, it absolutely will be. Because now I have to control four people, which is twice as hard as two people. Or I don't know, because I'm using the same amount of Joy-Cons. So who really knows? So we have my left hand, which will have player one and player three being Orgulon and Dr. Krigor. And then in my right hand, I have player two and player four being Ashley and Wario. And we're gonna play all five of these games, which is probably gonna be a little chaotic. This one probably being the most chaotic because it's for experts. Oh, splitting teams of two, try and trick each other. Hmm, how am I supposed to trick myself? I don't know if that's how that works. Okay, so let's start with Galactic Conquest, which is kind of like a board game. I have to set the grip hold. Oh no. Yeah, so it's basically a board game. We turn to little pieces, and we have to play micro games and make it to the rocket. Yeah, so whoever makes it to the rocket and has the most points will get it. Oh, add attention. Um, oh. There we go. No. Dance. Yes, we, we are dancing also. So surprisingly, this won't be as accurate because I have to have all four people. Because some people will get better accuracy than others for some unknown reason. I guess because then the positioning is not going to be exactly perfect. So it will really be a guess, or I guess a shot in the dark of who wins. I can't even tell. I mean, so far, I got no idea. But I mean, we are dancing. We're doing great. Oh wait. Yeah. This is the greatest dance show of one person playing as four people you've ever seen. We are doing pretty good otherwise. Yes, this is the first micro game. Very weird. <laughs> I mean, luckily, it's not like I have to hold eight Joy Cons, or. Yeah, eight Joy Cons. Otherwise, that would be even more chaotic. <laughs> Just holding four. Oh, okay, so player two got fourth. Interesting. Okay, so. Wario got first, being my right hand yellow. And I also have to press OK. Now, luckily, the pausing should be on a minimum, mainly because I disabled the pause button on both my yellow controllers. And then whatever ones you land on... Yeah, so also you don't really know what you're going to land on unless someone has already landed on it. So I have to divide my points among the other players. Jeez, not a good start for Wario. And I actually played this before, and it was crazy. So player two was doing like most of the work, getting all the points, but just because player two got a little bit unlucky and kept swapping with player one, player one won. It was crazy. Yeah, so I literally have no points now. Well, I guess player four. I tackled all the characters. I have, and the worst part is I have to set the grip hold for all the characters. <laughs> That's gonna totally not gonna be annoying. Oh, I remember this one. Oh wait, I would have to do it like this because none of them are really being in the back. Get set. Okay, we have to start. Wait. wait. Okay. Oh, okay, yellow man again. Interesting. I really don't know why some people are better than others. Oh wait, I think because I did my right arm first and then my left arm, because again, I'm playing as four people. Oops. Wait, did they get the exact same placements? No, wait. Third, yellow, no, a little bit different. Yes. But Warrior still made him first. Okay, now I have to charge up. And we could easily swap places with other people. Go back to home. Oh my goodness. 
So basically, the last two rounds basically changed almost absolutely nothing. But despite Wario winning both the minigames, he is in last by the technical terms. And everyone else is tied for first. I even know how that happened. Wait. Do I? How am I going to do this? Um. Eat 30. Oh, I just had to eat 30. Okay. People are. Oh no. Okay. Oh, hold up. No. Yeah, okay, this is gonna be absolutely random. Whoever wins. Because I'm gonna have to be controlling all four people. And I also have to remember to recalibrate it. Whenever they fall off. And they're also gonna get teleported. So four player one is winning? Not by much though. <laughs> they have to eat 30. This might take a while. Oh no. Because they also lose one each time they fall. This is gonna be the longest minigame. Cause they're just gonna fall off. I can at least control the two people, but even then, that's gonna be a really difficult. Okay, I think player one will win. What if they just a time limit? I feel like the time limit would just be a lot easier, especially just so that, well, it won't take forever. Because, I mean, look at the placements. Player one has, well, 12. And everyone else is basically in the single digits. Yeah, this is the most chaotic minigame so far. Yeah, okay, maybe I'm- I, it feels like I'm a little biased with player one for some reason because I- the only- because player one is getting the most, but it just- it's harder to control them. Yeah, okay, maybe this was a mistake. Most of the other minigames, I can at least do it in concession and try and get a similar score. But for this one, it's basically- I either make one person just win or have two people at least do equally great. But even then, that's gonna be difficult. Also, is my head getting bigger? My character's head, not, not, not in real life. You don't know, I think there is. Yeah, okay. I wonder who won. <laughs> yeah. I just turned into a, a giant dinosaur. Yeah, there was no way I could avoid that. I don't know what you wanted me to do. And there you go. Okay, so now I have to control player one and shake up the or charge up. And we have to launch it. And luckily I get a three and I move five spaces. Okay, that one was really good. And of course the space the space after I land on the space doesn't count for anything, so that's good at least. Oh no, not this. Okay. Remember, do them both at the same time. No, I guess do them all. Wait. Oh no, this is just like the last one. In a weird fashion. Oh boy. Yeah, because some will do better than others just because I'm kind of doing them both in consecutively. I don't want player one to win again, because that just feels unfair. But it's so hard to control all four people individually. Or even just half. Like, even if it's not just all four, because technically, I could make two in one hand go other one way, and then the other, but it's kind of hard. I think player one might win. It's definitely not player three. Player four could also win. Wait, what do these do? Oh, I think these boost me up. Literally. Ooh, maybe? Hold up, where's red? Red, where are you going? But yeah, I think blue is going to win. Yeah, okay. That one was... That one was surprisingly closer than I expected. Oh, so we're racing for love. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> but, depending on Orgulon's role, it could easily change the entire game. Because, like, the point distribution... That's crazy. Like, the, the crazy sheer amount of unfairness. This one. Uh, for the next turn, you can only reach the goal... Oh... Okay, so I have to land on four exactly, but it's only for the next turn. And chances are Herpulon will win, unless I don't know. Oh, oh I remember this one. Uh, hold up. Okay, now this one is basically luck, 
So it could be anyone's game here. Choose and pluck. Uh, yeah, let's pick this one for Arbulon. And then for Assume player two, this will probably get tangled up, but that's okay. I mean, at least this one, everyone has an equal chance to win. So at least we won't have to worry about any unfair buys. So that's good, at least. But yeah, if someone gets like a swap with first or last, Choose that would be crazy. Because like I said, it's anyone's game. At Assume first, when I was point. playing this, I thought it was like, like, is it whoever makes him sneeze loses? <laughs> I didn't think it was like this, choose so. And pluck. Also, how did I just choose all the ones that were in, like, middle? I don't know. And who's ever the longest wins, which it looks like it's Dr. Kragors. Yeah, okay. Okay, and, yeah, Dr. Kragor. So if Dr. Kragor gets a certain, a certain space, AK one that will let him swap players with first. I think that's how it is at least. He will win. Player three, come on. Oh wait, it's is the other one. <laughs> Casually forgetting where it is. Oh, distribute points, no way. That's seriously rough. Every single one of your points just gone. For the next game it's double the points. So now, basically, if Orbulon wins, he has a very... Mm, it's kind of in the middle. Oh, I, I remember this one. Okay, so this one is kind of like one of the other micro games where you have to get make them flip. Spins. But you have to get Three, 30 spins. Two, one, so this one will start. also be in the air. So basically, any of them where I'm doing the exact same motion, everyone has a kind of equal opportunity because... Not even equal, because sometimes... Just some Joy-Cons have a better movement than others. It's like, I'm doing the exact same motion, but player one seems to be- Oh, and now it's player two. <laughs> See what I mean? It's like literally up in the air. Whoever wins. Because I'm doing the exact- I, at least I tried to. Because if I was doing the exact same motion, I guess- Good. You know, player- everyone would tie. But that's just sadly not how it works. Also- <laughs> Why is there a odd, or not really odd, but I guess it is odd, but everyone has moved to this tile, no way. That literally just changed the game. Orbilon could have won. Now it's anyone's game. Although technically, if Dr. Krygorn makes it, while well, he will get 150 points, it's whoever has Assume the most the points by the time someone gets the rocket. Okay, so now we have to pull the toilet paper. Again, one of the ones Real where game. anyone could win because it's three. Because I'm Two. doing, I try and do the one. exact same motion, but it's not yeah. exactly easy. So who knows? Ooh, Finish. it looks like player two wins again. And uh, who who ties or who who gets the others? How did player one and player three get the? Okay, I guess that makes sense, but I would assume that there would be some difference. But I mean, okay. So Ashley would probably want to get a high number because any low number is kind of bad except one. That was oddly convenient. Yeah, Ashley could easily win now. And is there, I don't even think there's a specific amount of turns. I think it's kind of just infinite until someone gets the rocket. Oh, I know this one. This one was also shown in the trailer where people kind of shake. Come on, player two. Another one where it's kind of anyone's game. Three, two, Although, maybe one, maybe a little bit stop. odd because some people, well, maybe the left hand and the two left hands should have about the same movements, and so would the other two. But three and four. Two and four, that's what I meant. And then, so let's see. So far, everyone's doing the exact same, so let's see. Who loses first? I don't know. Oh, player. Okay, player one this time. With a huge amount. Oh, wow. But yeah, it's kind of weird. But you don't exactly know what to expect despite them being in the exact same. Well, player one and four, three do kind of have similar scores, but player two did terrible. Despite being on the same side of four. Oh. Oh, that is rough. Oh, my goodness. Orbilon now might lose because of that space. Every next game is double the points. Seriously, 
That is just so crazy. Oh, okay, so this one, I think you have to shoot the thing. Really stab it. Oh, wait, there we go. This one is gonna be particularly hard for some reason. Because, like, how am I going to shake them both at the same time? I, I don't even know. Oh. But just put them all in the corner. That's not even gonna work. Come on. <laughs> Basically, just gonna stab things and try and get hits. Uh, stab. We're doing great, buddies. Uh, I'm not doing great. It's hard, man. Wait, did, I think someone just got the special golden duck thing. Uh, it's not exactly an easy way to recalibrate it either. Player 3 is getting zero points. Wait, I think player two just won. <laughs> player three got 20 points. Great job, player three. <laughs> player three's just de depressed. <laughs> Sad. Yeah, player three has not been doing the best. But even then, player three is still in third. Because of <laughs> the last one. Okay, so now, I think the best thing to get is probably one of anything but a six. But at the same time, who really knows? Okay, <laughs> I guess you don't want to get that. Oh my, no way. Wait, two dice phase? Ooh, interesting. But even if Orbulon makes it, he could still lose because 150 points would only get him tied with third. Assume the point. Well, uh, again, assuming that, well, I don't know. I mean, I guess technically it would be above, but you get the idea. Okay, there we go. Your rear. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know, man. But I didn't even get that many points. <laughs> Zero out of ten. What if just no one gets any points? Okay, and what? Okay, what am I doing wrong? What if no one wins? <laughs> Actually, what does happen if no one wins? Oh, wait, Blue got it. No way. Okay, so Blue might be the one who wins. Unless everyone else somehow gets 25. Yeah. Yeah, okay, that one's just the hardest. I don't know why. Finish. Also probably one of the weirdest ones. Yeah, I, I just don't question it. Okay, so what Overkidon does not want to get is any of the ones in front of him. The worst, I don't know, because the worst could easily just be that, but at the same time, Orlon doesn't have a lot of points. Oh, he goes back to start. That is rough. This just goes on infinite. I have to do all the other ones, but we can't just stop without a winner. This doesn't feel right. Assume the form. Oh, it's this one again. Okay. Who won last time? I think it was player two. But again, everyone... <laughs> this is one of the ones where the everyone kind of has an equal opportunity. Three, because it's two, not exactly certain one. who will win. Start. Despite doing basically very similar movements. Because right now, player... Uh, four is winning. For now, at least. Yeah, I th and that's the rough thing. Because they're all going at the same movement, it's not exactly easy to have a better score. Despite someone getting the better score. But everyone else did pretty well, Good. too. Okay, now, will Ashley land on a good space or a bad space? Because most of the spaces are really bad. The best one would probably be a two. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, is it just double dice now? Oh, okay. For the next, oh, okay, but probably because it's taken forever. <laughs> it makes sense. And for this game, it's double the points. Okay, I think unless Ashley lands on a distribute points round, I think Ashley has it. Oh, it's this one again. Okay. <laughs> there are so many Joy Cons. <laughs> it's just so hard. Now this one is also a faced one. Um, I think always for the first one, I want to choose the middle. Although this game kind of reminds me of Bowser's Big Blast in a weird way. I don't know why. 
I think just because of what you're doing, it almost feels luck based, but at the same time, it's whoever's nose hair is the longest. A sense I would not think I'd be saying. And I am. So who really knows? And why did I do a pattern again? Assume the form. <laughs> you can't not just do a pattern. But then player four just ruins it all. Okay, um, which one should I pick? And I'll pluck. pick the green one. I almost picked the wrong one. And okay, it looks like Ashley might win this time. Or oh, maybe not. I think it's gonna be player one. Yes, yeah, so we're descending. Okay, now I have to find the right, jo the Joy-Con. <laughs> it's so hard. All the Joy-Cons are just conjumbled. They're probably gonna get tangled. It'll be fine. Okay, so the worst one would probably be... Oh, wait, yeah. Yeah, right, because I can get double. Okay, that one is really good. What is that? Swap the positions of start and goal. Are you kidding me? No way! What? So technically, if Wario wins this, he could win it all. Because point. all he needs is a two or higher. And that is five out of six. Really? And in. same thing with Dr. Krygor. Three, he might not two, win, one. but at least he could try. Okay. Okay, so basically, I think player Finish. two might win. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know why. Why does that happen, though? Again, I guess because the positions aren't exactly perfect. But Ashley could still make it back. <laughs> oh, and wait, that also means that the points for going back and forth are reversed, because now you actually don't want to win. And I think if Ashley gets a good number, Ashley wins. Good. Oh my goodness, no way. And since Ashley receives 150 points, yeah. She has a guaranteed victory. Talk about a turn of events. Although player one and player two seem like they did the best. Even despite player one being last. Hmm. That is actually really funny. Like that like that just defies the luck. Probably one of the most chaotic ones so far. But granted, that's the first one. Okay, so now we have Listen to the Doctor. Yeah, let's do that one, because. I don't think I've actually played that one, because I, I played this before, I think one of my first times. And then this one I just did because for some reason I want to. Yeah, okay, this one's... This one might be weird, but that's okay. What, are we just patients? Yeah, we are. We look weird. Like, those arms do not fit. Who go first? Wait. Oh no. What? I need player two. Player two. Okay, now luckily. While blinking rapidly. What? Peck. Huh? Player three. Wait. I need player three. While repeatedly jumping, fit your face. Wait. I think I literally need all four people. Player four. Fashion because what I have to do is I have to listen to the While doctor. puffing out your cheeks. But, of course... Colors. Oh. Because technically, I would have to do what the doctor says. But technically, everyone else doesn't have to wave their arms because I'm all four people. So like, while I could do that and wave my arms, it doesn't really matter. I'm all four people. Player <laughs> so this one is basically one of the only ones where I kind of need all four people. Your hips, left, like, I could right. do it or not. And Catch the fish. of course, well, they don't have to wave their arms because I'm all four people. <laughs> so how many rounds does this go on anyway? Uh, yes, they did. They absolutely did. So how many- oh, now it's player two and three. Together. Wait. Crocodile. I need player two and three. While skipping together. Yeah, okay, that's- that's Look. just weird. And this one just might be hard. But if I don't play a microgame, 
I don't. Interesting. I could just. I could just do this, but again, it doesn't really matter what I think. Whether they did or not. Love struck. Wait, how am I supposed to do this with only one drink? Hopscotch. I don't have a hopscotch for it. I love destroying hopscotch. But yeah. How many rounds does this even go on for? Like, is there a certain amount of likes I have to give them? Or like, how does this work? I really don't Player even know. At attention. It's gotta be the hardest one. Any words you know in another language? Okay. Wiggle. Just like, just like put a Google translator. Um, no hablo español. <laughs> I did it, guys. But also, even if even if I did what I do, they could technically just not shake their arm or wave their arms. So this one just feels unfair. Not in the sense that it's just me. The technically that does seem unfair. With your legs but stretched out. Oh wait, I can sit. Stay yes. Down. Yeah. Okay. Th yeah. This one's the best one. I can just easily just sit down. But again, even you guys can't confirm that, except the Spanish one, because I did speak Spanish, so that's good at least. But at the same time, since I have no face cam, which I guess is kind of my fault here, Player three. you can't even confirm Scared. that. And even if you did, I could just say whistling. I... Wait, what? Lower what's heavier. Oh uh, yes, I love rustling other people. I can't rustle myself, that's not how that works. But how many rounds does this even go on for? And I don't even know how many check marks everyone everyone has. Okay, now it's one and four. Together. Tug of war. Okay. While doing hopscotch together. Yeah, this one's definitely just the weirdest one. I I don't even know. I question this. Yeah, this one just does not feel fair. Like, imagine if you had a couple together. They could just Player say that they did it, even despite not. While panting like you're eating hot food. And this one just also Come just out. sounds weird. Like, why? Like, why would people do this? At least the other one is kind of fun. This one just feels like I'm doing... I'm basically just doing regular micro games while doing random requirements that I don't even have to do because I'm playing with as all four Player people. Three. It's Jeez. not even gonna matter what I do. While acting like you itch all over. March. Plus this one just weird. Like like just just weird. Also I'm just not good at that one. <gasps> is is there an end? How many times does this end? Like, how many times does this go on? Because four. I don't want to do this because this is just regular micro games. Alternately closing your left and right eyes. I, I don't even want to see because... Okay. Yeah, I don't want to see that one. It, it's just... I don't even want to see who wins because it's not like it's going to matter. I mean, maybe you guys want to see, but... At the same time, it's like... Who cares? Player one, at attention. It's not gonna matter. While bracing yourself for intense shaking. What? Steer. Oh yes. Driving. Like it's like I said, it's really not gonna matter because not just because I'm all four people, but like it doesn't matter if I do it or not. Because I'm just gonna tell you I have not been doing anything that the doctor says. <laughs> like Oh, okay, so here's his emanation results. Who even won? And, like I said, I basically did none of them. Except the sitting down one and the speaking Spanish. How did player one win? Everyone else was pretty close. Sick player two. No one likes player two, apparently. Yeah, they all hate her because she won. Yeah, okay, that one is not definitely not my favorite. Like, it definitely seems cool, but at the same time, it's, like, not exactly good for one person playing as all four people. At least this one is at least more luck-based than this one, because this one, it's just how many times I shake my hands. And I don't even have to listen to the doctor because I'm all four people. It doesn't matter if I do it or not. 
And yes, that's maybe my fault because I don't know I have no one else to play with. But maybe this this is the mini game that that makes people run away. Okay, let's try this one. Okay, so now we're warriors and trying to face Medusa. I don't look. There's a little frog. Hopefully, nothing bad happens to it. Oh no! It turned to stone. And I think we have to basically run. Defeat so, Medusa. I don't know how that's gonna work. Three, two. So we, one, yeah, we have to just keep going stop. forward. Go, go, and then we have to attack it. Sky. Oh wait, we have to do migraines, right? Hit it. Oh. Oh, I lost. Freeze. Uh -oh. Um. Tug of war. Okay, this one should be easy, right? Hey. Yeah. Go, go, go. Wait. Go, go, go. How did- how is Ashley winning? Sky she actually got stuck in the snake. Pass. Oh, pass? Yeah, okay, no one- wait, how did Dr. Krygo win? I don't even know how that happened. Lifter. Why, why did Dr. Krygo win? Oh. Oh wait, I have to use both my hands, don't I? Okay. Freeze. Ooh. Also, the music when you're about to get frozen, I feel like that could just fit perfectly with Squat. Sonic drowning music. Squeeze. They all got it that time, but why did Dr. Krager dead dead get a different Freeze. fish? Oh, player two just dead now. So <laughs> Yeah, I mean I Fashion guess that's good. I don't know. Spin and toss. Wait. That worked. Yes, yeah, so who knows? Freeze. Ooh. But yeah, just play that music, but Sonic drowning. That just fit perfectly. Massage. Shake. And, oh, okay. That one's easy. Oh, but Wario lost. Keep going. Oh, okay, if Dr. Krager wins his main game, Squat. he could win it all. Chomp. Oh. Okay, yep, yeah, Dr. Krager. No! Wait, it's just player one, player two. Oh, never mind. We defeated it. So that one definitely is the shortest of the three so far, which I guess makes sense. And player two, player four, they're just dead. Okay, now we have go the distance, which we have actually seen before. This one is you just be better at mini games or micro games, and we're also gonna become boxers. And none of this actually fits. Like I, I do not imagine seeing any of them with that body. Okay, so whoever gets it gets a flashlight. Okay, player okay. one, player two. Love struck. So we have to beat the Hold other. On. Oh wait, it's gonna actually be a little bit harder. Oh wait, do we? Oh, we both have to do it. Okay. Yeah, we're working together. Duh. But now okay. it's player three and player four. Sky I'm just gonna keep holding both of them. Oh. Okay. Dude, player three, do better. Player three, I hate you. Okay, that one was kind of hard, especially because I had to do two different motions. Okay, so now it's all of us. Okay. Wait, what? How did player one and three win, but not player lose, but not player three and four? I don't even know. Big cheese. Okay, this one definitely has more together rounds. Uh oh. Okay, they both won that one, so that's good at least. Okay, now it's just Dr. Crackboard. I'm still gonna do the motions as all of them, or owning all the Joy-Cons, because I'm not gonna swap the Joy-Cons. That's just gonna be too much work. Especially when I'm trying to figure out who's actually going or not. I mean, I know which hand it's in, other than that, you know. So yeah, we just have to win more minigames than we lose micro-games. And if we lose, then we're just gonna be sad. Okay. Wait, okay, so we all win. So, 
This is basically player three. Whoever does the worst. Oh wait, just player three. I forgot who player three was. Oh no, player three. You're doing terrible. Okay, player three might be the first to lose. At least that's how it is so far. Big cheese. Oh boy. Oh, we just both did it at the same time. That worked. I guess it makes sense. Okay, now just player two. Is it getting faster? I don't even know. I mean, not that it really matters. Yeah, so if they all lose, who knows? Wait, what happens if they all lose at the same time? Oh wait, this one, yeah, that one's just easy. There was only no challenge to that one. Okay, now it's player one and four again. Yeah, this one's easy. Oh. Oh no. See, <laughs> easy. I definitely was stressing out a little. And we still have that last one, which player will be player three, crocodile. player one and three versus on. player one and two, or er, player one and four. I, I guess I won. Yeah. So left hand versus right hand, player pretty much. Nice. So that would be definitely Still an interesting postcards. competition. Okay. Yeah. This one's easy. Oh, wait, that's not postcard, is it? Okay, so now player three's out. So, oh, and now just the rest of us. Have attention. They literally get kicked out of the arena. Who is it? Oh. For some reason, player one didn't do well. Player two's destroying everyone. Player four. You know, player four hasn't actually won a micro game yet. Won one yet. Which is oddly convenient. In a weird way, because player two won the first one. Then player one, then player three. Player so player Sky four should definitely win this one. Block. What? I, I it... Yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't know about that one. I swear I was doing the motions. It's player harder. Two. It's harder to believe people when you don't see them. Which I guess makes sense. Okay, this one. Yeah, okay, that one's just easy. Ah. It's also funny how like some are easy and just some are really difficult. I guess that's how most Must not warrior not. games are. Like the face. Oh. Um. Yeah, okay, no one won that one. Okay, so player two could easily Forget lose or win. Wait, what wiggle. if they lose? Oh, okay, so yeah. we both have to wiggle. That's interesting. <laughs> there we, we're both tied up together. Mm. Player one. Okay, now just player one. Grab and pull. Uh. Yeah. <sighs> player one has lost. And now it's against my two, my right player hands. Four. I don't even need my left hand. Oh. Oh, I'm not supposed to touch the ground, am I? Come on, player four. You have to beat player two. Shoot you. Oh, wait, now we're together. Wait, no, we're actually racing. Oh, okay, so only some say together. Oh. And player two has won yet again. <sighs> the obvious winner. Okay, so... Now it just feels wrong to put player four and three together. Or player four and two. Because if player four wins, then they're just sharing the victory of player two. Which doesn't feel right, does it? Hmm. I don't know. Let's see. Rumble is currently off. The minigame cannot be played without Rumble. Okay, I guess I'll just turn it on. The fluffy versus the furry. <laughs> what? The, f the No. Fluffy versus furry. <laughs> that just no. Wait, could I just? Could I just do? Hold up. Let me try something real quick. Could I technically fight? Wait. <laughs> no, no, no. That's just unfair. Okay. Hmm. I feel like I could just do something like this. Although it feels wrong to put Wario and Ashley in the furry team. Yeah. Okay. This is just the weirdest one. Just right now. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Yeah, let's do it. Um, the side. Wait, could I tech do this? Hold up. Oops. Oh, I can't. Oh, so I literally have to be on this. I, again, this just feels wrong. Wait, what? Right hand. I think, I think we might be using the left hand. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, man. These are already the worst team names. Why is it Fluffy and Furry? 
<laughs> Why furry? I don't, I really don't know. But it is definitely player one. Fluffy team will play the game. Furry team will try and guess who is in control. Oh, wait. Oh, is this on one of those where I have to guess who's in control? So I think what's happening, right, is both, so both on the, both people on the fluffy team will do the same motion, but people on the furry team will have to actually guess who's actually controlling the mini game, micro game. Okay, so this is another one where it's basically only with four, four people. You know, that's not good. What should I just do? Just close my eyes? Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm just gonna show you guys as an example. So player three's Joy-Con is rumbling. Okay, shut up. And so that means they're the one actually controlling. The other team will look like they're playing. Okay. So player three is actually in control. Crocodile. Um, Remember. Okay. Yeah, this one's easy. Propose. Yeah, because they're both doing it at the same time. Crocodile. Oh, so I have to do three or uh -huh. four. Ooh. Okay, yeah, this one's actually kind of difficult. Like, realistically, it could be either or. Crocodile. Assuming they do it at the same time. Evaluate. Which, I mean, technically is true. Okay, I think for the, I think I'll do another one where I have my eyes open and have my eyes closed, because otherwise it just feels unfair. Yeah. So, and now I have to guess who I, but that just doesn't feel right though. Um. Yeah. This. Okay. Yeah. This just feels not unfair. <laughs> like, what am I supposed to do? What happens if I guess the right? Yeah, it was, I know it's player three. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> but then do I just do it again? Do I just... Oh, so it's between two rounds. Oh, okay. Now the furry team. Again, one of the weirdest names. I don't know, I'm confused, man. Wait a second. I know who Joy-Cons is buzzing. So, right, I can't actually win. What am I supposed to do? Yeah, because it literally tells you who's playing because of the Joy-Con rumble. So, even if I were to close my eyes, it's not even gonna matter. Because I already know who it is. <laughs> I really did not think about this, did I? So, what am I supposed to do? I really don't even know. Yeah, okay. This one just kind of hard. But assuming you do the same motions, the other players shouldn't be able to no. guess. Stay dry. I think I realized why most of these actually need more people than just one person. Like, at the first three could at least be played with solo. Smart. In a weird way, but kind of. Chomp. Well, not exactly. But since not the Joy-Con's movement are not always going to be synced up. Lifter. Eat the food. Yeah, so what am I even supposed to do here? Who's even in control of this player for, right? Yeah, so unless there was no rumble, I would literally be guessing. But even that's like a 50-50 chance. So what am I even supposed to do here? It doesn't even matter who wins or not. I don't... What am I supposed to do? <laughs> because... As long as I know who wins... It'll just... You know, like I said... It just... It's not Such even amazing. worth it at this point. Match colors. Because like... I already know who's in control. And yeah, it's not like I could just change personalities. It's not how it works. Okay, now this one is just difficult. Um, 
Oh, so I actually have to win the micro oh, game in order to move on. Okay, that's interesting. Interesting. Fashionista. Yeah, I think this is probably Find why there's this is need for, for for multiple people. That might be why, and especially for scales. It's kind of sad how Grab and pull. these some some micro games can technically be played one person I in a weird way, but that's because not everyone's motions will be synced up perfectly. So it's not exactly going to be perfect. And that's just the issue. So it is kind of sad. But at least three of the four. Wait. It was player one? Okay, this time I actually literally thought it was player, player three. I literally actually thought it was player three. How did how did I not even know? Okay, this time I can wait. Okay, I can at least confirm it's player two this time. But like, I can win, I can lose, but it, it's not even gonna matter. Okay, this is honestly kind of a sad mini game to end off with, especially because it's not like it matters. Fly. It doesn't matter who wins or who loses because, no, it's not because I'm in control. Well, no pun intended, I swear. Bump it. But like, I'm, I'm really both not, not because I'm both people, but I really have who in control. Of who's gonna win? And who's gonna lose? Crocodile. So that's just the difficult part. I know who's who. It's just like with the doctor one. I already know who's. Like, whether I'm doing the motions or not. It doesn't matter if I shake my hands or not. But I know it was Ashley. I hope it matters. If it was just Wario. <sighs> yeah. Uh -huh. It's kind of disappointing. I almost just want to do another one just so I can give the satisfying ending. Wait, the score is tied. Which calls for a tiebreaker round. For tiebreakers, players switch after succeeding at three games. Wait, what? Oh. Okay. What happens if I just get the same again? Okay, this time it's player three. I don't know why I'm telling you guys. I guess it doesn't really matter because I'm gonna do the same motion. It's not like you guys can see me. So, I don't even know. This is kind of sad though. Especially for the final one. I thought this one was gonna be a lot more interesting per se. Just because, like, it it was the only one that actually needed four people. All the others could be played with two Lifter. or three. But since this one had four, I was like, oh, this one could be a good one to play with uh, for the last one because it would be the most interesting. Okay, so how would the tiebreaker round work? Okay, so I'm literally just gonna have to guess. I know it was player three. So, can I... Does there have to be a definite winner? Is it just gonna be infinite? I don't even know. Yeah, so I don't really, I really don't know. Cause if they get it correct, which I guess I would know. So, who knows? Okay, so now it's player four. Yeah, I am kinda disappointed that this is the final mini game. Or the final mode. Squeeze! Like, just, I feel like it would have been something a lot more interesting. Scott's but this is just a similar thing with the yes. doctor one. In the, in the fact that it doesn't matter who wins or who loses. Or I guess it doesn't matter what Arch. I do because I already know who's the one Crouch winning. The okay, this one might actually be difficult. Okay, just kidding. But this one was just easy. <laughs> but I already know who's it. And I basically decide the fate of the game. <laughs> Cause like if I choose incorrectly, you know, it's just gonna be sad. And of course it's Wario. So would there be more tiebreaker rounds or just how would this work? Cause like if it's infinite, I don't know. Tiebreaker. Wait. Is there just gonna be infinite tiebreakers? 
Okay, so first of all, I might have accidentally broke something, so I had to replay it over again. But now we're on the fi well, the last final round for player one and player three. And I thought, well, it feels wrong to decide who's gonna win because it just doesn't feel right for me. So I've made a proposal. So I have this wheel. And if I go and interact with it, we can spin the wheel and decide who will be the one to win. My left hand or my right hand? Okay, my right hand is the one that wins. Yep, close that. And there we go, now we can just hide that. So now I have to, I have to guess correctly who is going to win. So my right hand is the one that wins. So, shoot, who actually was it? It was player one. Okay, good. Yeah. Imagine if I just get it wrong. It was player one, right? Okay, it was. And now for this next one, I will have to guess incorrectly on purpose. So I can put my joy con down. Oh, I guess I can't. And, and now the team names are more reasonable and not like furry. Like, seriously, that, that was just the weirdest part of this video. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay, so player two. Okay, look, I know the little battery will be fine. Don't worry. So now player two is control, but I have to get Wario for this one. Fly. I think the wheel is definitely a good, good investment. Because, I mean, what else was I supposed to do? I mean, I guess I could just make you guys vote. But that just doesn't feel right. You know? Like, I, I just make a poll. Hey, who do you think should win? Or, like, who do you think is better, left hand or right hand? But, I mean, what am I supposed to do about that one? So, yeah, now I have to guess Warrior. I guess after I finish this. Trim. Okay, there we go. And now, we have to guess Wario. Because player two is the one controlling and we have to guess incorrectly. So player two or the right hand can win. Because otherwise, I'm pretty sure the tiebreakers will be infinite. Which is kind of sad. So now they should cheer. Yeah. Because Ashley was the one that was in control. AKA player two. And now that they've won, that means no more tiebreaker. Yeah, the results will end. Yeah, I wonder who wins. Wow, the Marvelous team wins. That's so crazy. Yeah, this one, the Who's in Control show, that one is definitely something that you absolutely need four different people for. Because then it's just not right. Just like, like listen to the doctor. Because at that point, it's just me guessing. Any, or I guess this one, I already knew who was in control. Like, what was I supposed to do? Or for this one, it was basically, I didn't even have to follow the doctor's directions because I could say who wins or not. So if you were to play with this with only one other person, it could definitely be these three. Because at least these three, those are at least something fun that you can do if you're on your own. Otherwise, I would definitely recommend if you play with other people. Maybe not this one, this one's kind of weird. But the other four should be fine. Or, yeah, yeah, the other four should be fine. But this one's only for four people, so these are kind of like the main ones you have to work with. And then this one, but we don't like that one. But definitely some pretty fun to do if you have if you have multiple people. And I definitely recommend it. It is kind of funny, though. Just how weird this game is. Just from the micro games. To, oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that sounds about right, though. To listen to the doctor, probably one of the weirdest ones so far. But it still has a good amount of fun. And so, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time.